One, two, three. One, two, three. Hey everybody, the Reese Viral here, and welcome back to more Breath of Fire 2. Okay. Oh. So that opens that up. Great. <laughs> yeah, auto. Get out of here, Beazel Bob. Oh no. Oh shit. I was gonna say, poison attacks are a bad thing. Hot damn! 137 though. Nice damage. So. Oh, shite. Come on, man. I wanna get to that chest. Downside is, to get to it, I need to go through. Shit. I need to get through this gate and then step on a switch which makes it go down. I want the chest! There we go, we got him. Lin is level 18. Holy shit. Which one of these? Aha! Found it. You have initiative. Good. Death blow. Magician mummy day. <laughs> that one's also dead. Nice. Two death blows in a row. Not too shabby. Right, I want to get to the, the thing. Woo! Shit. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, that's still enough to kill it. <laughs> that isn't. Perfect. Hey, I mean, if I keep getting into fights, it's all it's all good. More XP, you know. A silk glove. Fuck. Finally. I don't know who should equip it, to be honest. Oh, that must be only for certain people. Ah. 52 to 56. She's the only one that can use it. Boom. Well, there you go, Lynn. Enjoy. No. I'm just realizing something. Hmm. Now I'm thinking that I might actually have to drop down and redo the room. So I'm noticing that once a switch has been stepped on, you can only step on it once. It's looking that way. <laughs> oh man. Although if every switch makes it go up. Oh dear. Oh no, if like it goes up on the next switch I step on, then down, then up, then down. I need to count out. It's so essentially, it's currently down. So, up, down, up. Up, down, up, down. Up. Down. Up. Oh. Bollocks. Oh man. I think I might go to that hole in the floor. No, oh, Ran's level 14 at least. Yeah, I'm going back. <laughs> well, shit. Bit of a pain in the ass. I don't know how far, like, how far down it's going to drop me, but don't really matter. I may have to just fight a few more things, but I don't mind. I want what's in the chest. That's all. Okay, didn't counter-attack. All's good. And as I say, more XP. So <laughs> it works out. Whee! Oh, right. Okay, that's perfect. Because that literally just allows you to restart. Nice. 
I might have to go through a, a bit more, but I'm not entirely sure. Oh no, don't know. Here we go. It's literally just to the left. And boom. <laughs> I hate how much damage that does. It really does a bit much. No big deal, I suppose. Right. So... I mean, it looks like I could actually just avoid this. Entirely. I don't need to worry about the second... Uh oh. Oh dear. I think I'll do some healing. No, I don't need to worry about the second gate that had one chest behind it. Because I've already got opened that. Also use Rand. Just get him to heal us up. Uh, yeah, we're fine actually. He has 53 AP. Jesus. <coughs> and we win. I can't believe they are quicker than Rand. He's so slow. It's a bit crazy. Now that opened that up. Uh, oh god. Alright. Boom. <clears throat> Alright, so I'm just thinking how I can do this, because I can only step on one each switch once. So that shut that down. That opens that up. I need to be really careful here. So, they've opened... Da, 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 da. Okay, I think I might just have to step on each switch around and don't step on the one that's at the top. Yeah, because that's one I can quite easily sidestep, so I think that's what it wants me to do. So it goes down. And then it goes up, nothing, down. Good, 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 good. There we go. Booyah! Alright, we picked up a Warlock Ring. And we picked up a Sage's Robe. Who the balls can these be for? <laughs> I don't really know. Oh god. Oh. Right, so. Boom. And. Fuck's sake. There's a high encounter rate here, it would seem. It's pretty crazy. Seemingly, yes. Mm. Perfect. Right, now I can actually get the heck out of here. Oop. Wait a minute, the stairs. Ooh. I'm just like, which do I go through? Uh oh. Oh no, not a curse. I don't actually know how curse works. Oh god, he's cursed. Oh dear. Oh no. Do I have anything to remove curse? No. Panacea. Cure any bad status. That should work then. Cool. I don't like that. It makes me want to equip him with a charm or something. Oh, we don't have any. Oh, bugger. I think I sold them. Well. Wait, so I can go in here. Oh, it leads nowhere. Oh, never mind. Oh, I probably have to fall from above. Yeah, I'm gonna guess. Oh, but bollocks.
Okay. Cool. There, good. I'm really scared about fighting these things now. I now know that they can poison. Not poison. Curse. It's just... Um, I don't like it. Oh, uh... Oh god, I need to be careful and not fucking fall. What the hell are these things? Acorn Knights. There's not six of them. Thankfully. What on earth? Oh god, they ain't dead. Combo attack. Great. What the shit are these? Great, they're able to attack twice. Perfect. Alright, one of them's down. These are really weird. I mean, look at them. That's actually a sprite that would be completely ruined if I used a different XBR shader. It wouldn't, like, mix all... It'd mix the pixels where their eyes are together. And it would just... It would... I don't think... I would probably say it would ruin it. I picked up a wisdom brace. Oh, I was waiting for the noise. Uh, Fuck. Ooh, alright. Okay, three of these. Fashions. Fashions. I don't know what the hell they're called. Yeah, I really don't. Not a clue what they're supposed to be called, or how to pronounce their name. I mean, the way it looks, it looks like F-A-C-H-E-N. Which, to me, would be fashion. Oh, fashion. Ginseng. Really? Ginseng? Ooh, I got lucky. Oh god. I almost didn't walk off of it. Wisdom fruit. So I picked up a wisdom brace. Who the hell could equip that? Oh my god, more of these. They actually have a fair amount of health. It would appear. Great combo attack. Of course. To be fair, they aren't really doing much. Oh no. It takes all of us to take out the Acorn Knights. They're tough. <laughs> so it would appear. No death blow. Really? Oh my god. I love how Ren takes the least damage. God knows how. Right, either way. Oh no, it's the Iron Band. So who the hell can use that? Oh, it's there. Ah, increases wisdom. I think wisdom is your spell. Like, power. In which case, I think I'll give it to him. If that is what it is. I'm not entirely sure. Heal. Boom. 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 Only downside is he's running. Running low. But when it comes to AP. Oh, there is more. Okay. Oh no, not two orcs. Whatever will I do? I knew that was going to happen. Ah well. <laughs> there we are. Perfect. Very nice. What the fuck? Oh! Very clever. Aha! Welcome to my parlor, my knight in shining armor. It seems introductions are in order. Please call me Nympho. So, handsome, what kind of fun will we have first? Oh, you're just lighting up all over. Come here, sweetie, don't be shy. Oh god, she floats. Hmm, something wrong, sweetie? There's a frog in your throat. Oh, a frog sent you to me. How sweet. It's a shame I don't know any frogs, or I'd be happy to reward. Oh, that frog. Hmm. So he wants me to change him back. Well, that's perfect. In exchange for my services, you'll give me some service yourself. Oh god. Don't worry, handsome. You're not like that ugly frog. I'm not going to change you into anything. I'm just going to keep you with me forever and ever and ever. Oh no. Wait, where are you going? You're not leaving me, are you? Is it because I'm a witch? Is that it? You're scared of me, just like all the others, aren't you? 
Hey, there we go. I knew it. You're just like all the other men I bring here. Nobody really loves me. They just come, have their fun, then run run out on me the minute I give them an opening. Well, this time you won't be getting away. I'll just rip your soul out, then you'll have no choice but to love me forever. Have at, <laughs> have at you. Whenever I see that, it reminds me of Monty Python. Did she just throw the... Oh, she did. No, don't taunt. I wanted to use a... Okay, I can't use any of those. Never mind. I can do Jolt, but then I'm fucked for healing. Ah, who cares? Uno! Sir Moon. 48, so we've done over 100. Let's have a like 250. Wow. This is not going to be hard. Nah. And then just do the same. And then you can attack. Probably going to have it done after the th either this turn or the, s or the third turn. For sure. Oh, she can heal herself. Never mind. Is it only going to be by 40, though? Yeah. How worthless. Wow. Alright. Actually, we could, should be able to deal with her in just attacks. Boom. One. Two. She dead? Fucking easy. Oh, my. Rand reached level 15. <laughs> Jesus. Not surprised. Why, but why? I've never lost to anybody before. Why me, the most beautiful witch in the land and not a suitor to her name? No one but that hideous, slimy toad. <laughs> you win. The spell on, that fr on the frog can be broken by the kiss of a fair maiden. Now please, leave me be. Oh. Whoa, she has kids. She's like the old fairy tale of a princess trapped in a tower by an evil sorcerer. I wonder if she'll ever understand that she's the captor in the story too. Ah. Okay, so she just says the same. Alright, okay. Do -do 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 -do. Alright, so... Oh, Christ. Could I just drop down here? I do wonder. I might just try it. Oh, I can't. Oh, man. I just realised there's an exit over here. To the right. You have initiative. Perfect. Acorn Knights don't stand a chance. I really wish I could have multiple people in, in the party at once. It would just make it so much easier for like getting around. No, what I mean is I'd quite happily get rid of Sten for like Nina. Only downside to that is I need Sten on the overworld. Like for certain things in the overworld and it blows. Oh, uh, never mind. So what's in here? Did we just fall? Oh god, we did. Ah, so that's a quick way out. Oh. Oh my god, the, the kids are back. Talk about a petrifying experience. People tell me I have a chiseled appearance, but I don't care if I get turned into an object. <laughs> into an object de art. Very nice. Now what I want to do is go to the platform room. Which honestly shouldn't take that long, I don't think. Nah, I think we're nearly there. And instead of going to the right, I want to go to the left this time. Alrighty-ho. Oh my god. <laughs> Literally three steps. Brilliant! Oh, can you imagine if the enemies had um, a, like, dying blow? It's so like, just before they die, they hit you with something. That shit would suck. Alright, so this is... close. But no cigar. <laughs> yeah, 
There we are. Level 19, Jesus. And I'm pretty sure to get over to the left, to the left side of the room, I just need to go on the rightmost platform. Because they're laid out the exact same. And the leftmost one took me to the right side of the room, so the left, the, the left, the rightmost one should take me to the left side of the room. Has Sten leveled up at all? I just don't recall seeing him level up. Is all. He's level 17. I don't think he has leveled up. Rand's leveled up like two or three times. Lin has leveled up two times. Crazy. Well, Sten, Sten will level up once we... I think I'd need... I'm trying to think. About 2000 XP. Of course he'd get poisoned. Shit, I don't even know if I have a antidote. No, I do. I do, I do. Right, so... Yeah, we do have an antidote. Luckily... Hundred AP, Jesus. Oops. I didn't realise that auto went on to yes. There we go. Do -do 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 Please. Yeah, there we go. Easy. Oh my god. Step off the platform. Battle! It's always the way it is. It's bullshit. <laughs> there we go. Very nice. So we got 608. He should be close. We're getting like a hundred each. After each battle, I mean. Right, so... Oh, I know where this leads, I think. Yeah. I mean, if I look to the north, there should be a kid. And then there'll be a wall separating them. I think? Yes. I mean, I'll, I'll find out as soon as I get there, so... We shall see. Ah, there we go. Yeah, it is. Eh, yeah, what am I doing here? Oh, that's right. I got into a fight with Nympho at the top, and I think she turned me to stone. I think. Well, that explains how stiff I'm feeling. Oh, so you're the ones who broke the spell, are you? Pleased to meet you. I'm Sesso the Water Shaman. No, if you'll excuse me, I gotta go find Granny and my sister Sanamo. Who knows what kind of trouble they've gotten into while I was gone. Oh, could you not have opened this? Are you kidding me? Ah. Although, to be fair, getting out of here is really quick. Yeah, all I need to do is go down the stairs, go back to the platform room, fall, enraged. Oh! Okay. That made it sound like that was going to be much worse. So, I'll take it. There he is! Level 18. Perfect. He might have got to level 17 too, and I just wasn't paying attention. I don't really know. Okay, it's actually going to take quite a bit longer. Ah, oh, bollocks. Not these fucking things. Great. I mean, with this, I'm really just gonna have to hope for the fucking best. Yep, sadly. Healing herb. Perfect. Oh no. Shit. Wait, come on. If we keep getting initiative, it'll be fine. <laughs> right, so what I want to do... Let's go into this room. Fall down. Wait, I can't? Really? Okay, I'll just do this then. Because this works out just fine. Whee! I still love that noise. Whee! There we go. Back to the beginning. Though I should probably heal. I'm gonna say, because she's probably real close to death. Wait, rejuvenate. Oh, 100 HP. 
That's quite a bit. Should be fine. Bloody hell. <laughs> Although, to be fair, I have to go pretty damn far to get back to the camp. This cat's gonna be at 1 HP. Oh, no, she's at 24. Oh, she's fine. There we go, perfect. Be quick. Hurry! Fuck. Now she's gonna be at 1 HP. Oh no, 4. 4 HP. Kill it. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Right, this should be the camp. There it is, perfect. This place is perfect for camping. Wanna camp here for the night? Yes. I want to save, thank you! Right, so we need to go back to the forest. Which I think... is it just over here? Oh god, I don't remember. Oh no! We got initiative! Oh Jesus, I keep forgetting this thing's got a lot of health. Should have gone for the bomb plant first. Oh my god. Really? Charging up! Well, thankfully, Lin and Sten are powerful enough to deal with it. What I'm realising is actually the... The enemies for the overworld are actually more powerful than the ones that were inside the Witch's Tower. Bit crazy. Ah, oh, is it so? The kiss of a young mademoiselle will set me free of this deplorable curse. Then, as you say, give me your best shot. Ah, s'il vous plaît. Ah, you have found quite a fair young mademoiselle indeed. A kiss from her will shatter this curse all to pieces, no? He's French. It's no big deal. All I have to do is pucker up and plant one on him. <laughs> Right, pucker up and plant one on him. Easy. Here I go, wish me luck. She's like she headbutted him. Oh my god, alright. Oh dear. <laughs> okay, the kiss exploded the forest. Brilliant. Whoa. Oh, très bien, très bien. Now that was a kiss to make history. He's a frogman! Bonjour, ladies and gentle friends! And merci beaucoup! <laughs> oh, I love him. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is... Gr Greno... Grenoe... Hopper de... <laughs> Tapata, His Royal Highness of Fort... Nagur. Now... Shall we be going? I must invite you... All to see the place I call home has the most splendid view of the lake. As a matter of fact, it is right in the middle of the lake. The people will be most happy to have their beloved prince home safe and sound. But of course, his saviors will also receive, how oh you say, the royal welcome. Tapita joins the party. I really preferred his name in... non-translate... on the non-translated version. Yeah... Nothing against it. Like, Tapita. But he was called... Uh, I'm guessing it was, well, Jean, but it was probably pronounced Jean, or something. Oh, bollocks, I didn't realise what I was doing. Right, Lynn, Stan, tap it though. Oh god, look at his face. He's a right fat toad, isn't he? Fat frogman. Meanwhile, at the Legion of Doom. All right. Wait, where's this? Holy shit, really? Hey, check it out, it's done! What? Hide out into a full-fledged town! Now that's... Badass! Oh my god! Yeah, that's really cool! Wait, so what's his actual ability? Wrong thing. 
Holy fuck, we become a giant toad. Oh! And as a toad, I can do this. Awesome! Do -do 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 -do. Wow. Oh, whoops. I pressed Y. I didn't mean to. I meant to do that. Ah, oh, there we go. We're here. Can I... Oh, that's a box. The stairway leads underwater. What a nice place. Do, 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 do. Actually, hang on. If I've got... Can I just, like, travel around the world? Oh my god, I can. I remember there being hidden shit. It might be at the top of this place, actually. Ah, there we go. Yeah. A hidden place. We got the circlet. And we got the void sphere. Who am I, you ask? Here's a hint. It starts with a D and rhymes with... Dragon Sage. Wait a minute. Greetings, Shadow Ryu. Or oh, Ryu. I've waited many years for this moment. Hmm? Never mind what I'm doing in a place like this. What's important is I have something I've been wanting to get or waiting to give you. We got a new power. Oh. Well now there's a load off my shoulders. I was almost ready to say screw it and go back home. Hmm? What? You say an old man like me should act more responsible? Listen, kid, I've been waiting for you to show up for how no who knows how long. They have every right to goof off a bit. He just gave me a new ability, I know that. Yes. Oh, there we go, we got the dragons. Yeah, I had the whelps, but now I've got electric dragon, frost dragon, flame dragon. Not the whelp. So, yeah, very nice. Oh my god, he's got no health. Jesus. I should really go and buy him some stuff. Probably be a good idea. Actually, one thing I should do... Of course, I turn away from being a giant frog. We got some new things. Got a circlet. Holy crap. What was the other thing I got? Void Sphere. Is uh, what I think it was called. Do I know what it does? Nope. Use during battle. Oh. I did get, like, Sage's robes and stuff, but... Eh. Oh, balls, that's worse. Alright, whatever. Alright, now we can actually go to his place. Do 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 do. Or should I go back to... Our hideout. I love the fact, as a frog, I can just go where I please. Oh, we still fight stuff. Should probably be careful. These are all new! Oh dear. What does he do? Temporarily boost agility, and he has pierce. Okay, nine damage. One of them ran away. Oh no. The very, very little damage is not a good sign. I'm gonna go for the said jelly first. Oh, not C. C jelly. I don't like the scissor thing. One down. Yeah, Schizer Hermit. Oh dear. Oh! Okay. Yeah, I really should watch out. Jesus Christ. Three damage. Woo. Oh no. <laughs> This is really bad. Oh, 
Well, we got it. Jesus, that didn't even give us that much. Not really. I want to go back to the camp. <laughs> there it is. That was crazy. Do, 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 do. Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. All right, so now the only reason I think I should maybe go back to the hideout is because it showed us it. Like, meanwhile, and it says, like, this is what happened to the hideout. So it's like, maybe I should go. So can I do this? Oh, I can't. Okay. That kind of sucks. I do want to go back to the hideout, but it might take a while. Oh yay, stone face! Oh no. All good. It dropped. Earth up. Nowhere. I mean, I don't know how good that is. It just sounds really good. <gasps> Bloody hell! Fire! Can I give that to Tapita? I can. His figure goes down to zero, though. Yeah, don't care. He's not gonna get completely owned, no. Alright. Hmm. Fuck. Well, now I just want to go back to the bloody camp! This is where progress just stops being made because of bullshit. Wait. I'm curious if this is a, like, a town. Ah, home sweet palace. Welcome friends and gentle ladies to Fort Nag Nagur. So what do you think? Is it not splendid? Fantastic? Palatial? I owe you all a debt of gratitude. Feel free to enjoy the wonders of my home for as long as you like. Ah, my royal subjects, never fear, for your prince has returned. My people are like my family, you see. They will welcome you all with open arms, and... My royal subjects, is something the matter? Your beloved prince has returned from his captivity in the wilderness. Is this not cause for so much screaming for joy? Uh-oh. Is this the guy? I'm afraid so. It's the heat, I tell ya. Cook their brain a little, and they pull this kind of crap. Oh no, no! The fault Nelson, it hurts so. Do you know who you... Who you were practicing your wrestling moves upon? It is I, your prince. Stop the silly game at once. Yeah, and I'm the queen mother. Now hold still for a sec. What the fuck? <laughs> they wait on me at hand and foot. Mind you, I'd rather not be paraded through the castle in this fashion. Stop laughing, stop laughing this instant. Put me down, civil play. I have a reputation to up my hold. Hello? Oh no! My apologies for the, how you say, confusion. May I introduce myself? Uh... His Royal Highness has Royal Highness. Enchanté. As you must understand by now, the lowly vermin who gave you my name as his own he is an imposter. I cannot explain his actions outside of illness or madness, but nevertheless he remains quite convinced that he, in fact, is me. Tragic, is it not? On behalf of the good name of the royal family, it is my duty to apologise to you for his deception. I have arranged for a boat to return you to shore, you will find it outside. In addition, you will find quite a pricely compensation for your trials and tribulations on board. Now that this <laughs> Trey horrible business is behind us. May I ask you to depart? No way! If you are troubled as to the future of Fort that place, worry not. A lone troublemaker will not disrupt my kingdom. You shall be dealt with swiftly and fairly. You need not concern yourself. I am staying. If you are troubled as to the future of that... 
but, 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 but. Man. Fine, I'm going. Merci beaucoup. I am pleased we can come to an understanding. Bon voyage, my friends. Oh, there we go. I actually do, actually, get to move around. Ooh. The Deluxe Rod. Mm-hmm. <laughs> can I free, Gene? Welcome to the Armory. Perfect. <gasps> Holy crap. Crossbow. Oh, Bosch's weapon. Iron Knuckle. Oh my god. Oh wow, that's quite a difference. Yes. A copper baton. Iron Knuckle. Oh wow. I'm running out of money. Wait, Iron Plate. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Night helmet. So there. And the buckler. Oh right, yeah, the circle, it's the helmet. I forgot what it was. Woo! Jesus. Expensive. Right, so that's the inn. I want to help out Gene. I'm assuming that is actually his name. Uh, oh. That's what I'm hoping. Oh, hang on. The WC! Is it toilet? This is the Royal Dining Hall. We would appreciate it if Sir kept his dirt off the carpet. Oh, so that's not where he is. I do wonder where he is. I want him back. Hmm. Hmm, is something the matter? I am much too busy to speak with you. Please go away. The prince does not wish to be disturbed. Leave at once. Jesus! What do I have to speak with the king? Okay. He says nothing. Do 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 do. Oh, so that's the dining hall. Huh. Wait, what? I want to help out Jean. This is His Royal Highness's sleeping quarters. Entry is forbidden to unauthorized commoners. I know this is a switch. Yeah. So, Prince Apatow seems to have turned into a born again believer in the Church of Eva. Even offered to make me the castle preacher, he did. But I'd rather tend to the farm than tend to the flock. King's chambers are up this way. <laughs> just about to say, where have I not been? But I've actually explored near enough everywhere in this place. I want to help out my friend. I just have to talk to everybody. Underneath the castle, water flows, la la la. Through the dark dank sewers, it all goes. Happy memories I retain of those days when I would play a bucket ride to the world down below. Okay. So I think what I need to do is leave, but not leave. So, leave. Now wait, come on you stupid rock. Uh. Stupid thing, so freaking heavy. Wait, what is she doing? One, two, three. <laughs> Eat this. Um... <laughs> oh dear, you weren't supposed to see that. Please, hear me out. You see... 
Ah, someone's coming. Hey, what was that noise just now? Sounds like whoever was just here threw something in the water. Probably just garbage. Anyways, where the hell was the real prince all this time? Why didn't he show up sooner? Ah. Hey, you're not saying the guy upstairs is a fake, are you? I'm straight, I'm saying it. Not like anybody could tell, couldn't tell the difference. To tell the truth, I've had my doubts for the longest. The guy who just got locked up was the real Prince Tapita. No question about it. I'd recognise him buried under three feet of rock. So what do you think they'll do with the poor guy? Hope it's nothing too drastic. Hey, you're not being paid to gossip. Get back to work and guard that imposter. The one upstairs or the one in the dungeon? There's only one fake smartass and you know it. Back to work. Well, I knew the man was dense, but he really doesn't suspect a thing. Prince has only got himself to blame. Guy's a freaking migration instinct. Well, guy, maybe I'll slip him a cake or something later on. Oh dear. Look at them all, milling about like nothing's wrong. It's obvious to everyone who the real imposter is. The people ought to be trying to dispose him, but no. The imposter could order every man, woman, and child in this entire castle executed, and not a soul would stop him. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Water, I hate water. Someone help, I can't swim. I love them just sinking. What does Sten Sten say? I can't feel my parts. <laughs> oh my god. Hmm? Hey, you didn't tell me you couldn't swim. <laughs> Ugh. Ah, you're awake. I'm glad to see you're alright. That was what you people call drowning, wasn't it? <laughs> Ryu, can I beat the crap out of Froggy Girl now? What an experience, I must include it in my next magic act. I apologise about the water. But the situation would have been worse had the guards seen us. You heard it from... You heard it from them yourself. My brother, the True Prince has been imprisoned by an imposter posing as him. You must help me expose the imposter and save my brother from the dungeon. Let's do it. Here's a card press on gills. Using these you can breathe underwater. Of course they won't protect you from the pressure in deep water, but they should help you get around the castle. Tapita is being held in the dungeon below. With these press on gills, you should be able to find him. Please hurry. Okay. You can reach the docks by the underwater path. If you need to leave for any reason, you can use the boat you'll find there. Okay. You got it. Do 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 do. Awesome. There we go, we can go under here now. Mmm. Is there actually, like, fighting in here? No. Just creepy music is all. Do 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 you're a fresh face around here. You looking for some table scraps? They say you're not a real chef until you've cooked with a genuine green bottle. It's a rite of passage few ever accomplish. You... sure. What to make, what to make. I need a challenge. For my skill and for the taste buds, something epic. The kitchen is a chef's battlefield. Careful you don't get shelled or peeled. Jeez. So the way I must go is over here. Wait a minute. Who the heck? Oh god, I see worms. It smells so good, maybe I could sneak a bite while nobody's looking. Ah, ha, ha, gross. This woman was caught sneaking around the palace on some five-fingered errand. She's here to work off her sentence. Normally you can't leave these people alone for five seconds without them fi 
Filching food, but not this girl. Nothing tempts her. Not not the roaches, not the worms, nothing. She's some kind of freak, I tell ya. But I'm not complaining. Oh, okay. This cruel and unusual torture, standing guard at a feast we can't even taste. Damn, I don't get paid nearly enough to put up with this. I am wondering, like, whether or not there is... I was going to say more to this, but maybe not. The weird thing is, the boats... Oh, there's a cave here. I'm an idiot. Oh, that's what leads over here. Oh. Wait, what I should probably do, if possible, is speak with... the princess. You can reach the docks by the underwater path. Oh. That's not helpful. I'm like, how do I save him? Because the only it's only here, and then that's it. Boom. This is the only path. Unless no. I was gonna say unless I'm missing something, but maybe not. Kitchen's a chef battlefield. He does say shelled or field. Oh, he did. And then he just has the same stuff. What to make, what to make. Oh, I'm quite surprised I can't, like, go anywhere else. Where the hell am I, then? Like, I know I'm in the kitchen, but I'm also confused. Oh, hang on. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, uh, I can walk on this. There are worms everywhere, try eating one. Sure, why not? They'll make you sick if you eat them raw, though. Hmm. <laughs> Ew, no! Oh, I didn't even see this. I'm an idiot. Yep. <laughs> My bad. A real screwball, this one. Paints like an odd master, though. What? You're here to talk to this dimwit? Sorry, kid, but visit now is a never. Prince's orders, nobody gets through, except over my dead body. Why are you looking at me like that? Beat him up. Oh, so you want to fight me to meet the moron, eh? Must be a relative of yours. Diddly diddly diddly. Oh my, look at this guy. I'm just going to do a special. Let's do electric dragon. Oh. And a bunch of simoons. Boom. Oh god, okay, cool. So moon... Electric dragon attack! So what does this look... Ooh! Holy, wow. <laughs> that was easy. Level 18! That was totally worth it too. Oh, you guys are tough and stupid. What are you going to do that for? You did it! We had to kill the guard captain, but whatever. With Bozo, I mean that guard out of the way, we can talk to my brother. Come on, hurry. So he isn't called Jean. Oh. Hmm? 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 <laughs> Not the Dessin, it is all wrong. Our design, maybe. Not entirely sure. Tapita. Tapita. Ah, my dear sister. What may you be doing in this horrible place? Ah, Monsieur Ryu. Many apologies. I am afraid that my new chambers are not as luxurious as the ones you wish to see. I wish you to see. I am afraid I am too busy, busy being miserable with my current predicament to bring much conversation to the table. Is there something you wish to ask? I made a help. Hmm? C'est vrai? I, I don't know what they are. Words cannot express the gratitude I am feeling right now. Wait, I know. Let me put the finishing touches on my masterpiece. Consider this your just reward for all the aid you have given me. Stop doodling and listen to us for a moment. That jerk has stolen your face is walking all over you and your kingdom. How can you take all this sitting down? Ah, it is not that I can, but that I am. Surely you understand. What use has a wandering artiste such as myself for trifling things as titles? If the world wishes to call me Tapita instead of Prince, c'est la vie. There is still only, only one moi, and that is all that matters. 
You big dummy. This isn't just about you, you know. What about me? I've been worried sick. And you, you just smile and nod while your kingdom's getting stolen. No, no, do not weep for me, my sister. There are much mo much worthier things in life for that. We. Oui. Yes, being trapped in this awful place is not a fate to my liking. Perhaps it is time I say... Now I how you say flew the coop. On the subject, have I told you about the royal signet? It is the symbol of the royal family. My father and all his fathers that came before were in possession of that ring. Naturally, it was passed down to moi. Of course, the royal signet. That's the key to clearing up this mess. Royal signet is, a sim is the emblem of succession. There's only one of it, of its like in the entire world. We can show it to everyone. They'll have to recognize Taffeta as the real prince and dethrone that fraud. Travian, my sister, go and show it to them. You are supposed to have it, remember? Ah, but of course. My head, it must be in the clouds, no? My dear Mon <laughs> Monsieur Ryu, it appears I must ask for your services yet again. You see, I gave my ring to that charming yet vexing young lady, Nympho the Witch. Seems I must retrieve it. Will you do this for me? Will you retrieve me for me my ring? You did what? You let your ring get stolen by some spell singing hussy? No, no, you misunderstand. Nympho, she's a very good witch, just not very good with people, yes? I gave my ring to her, you see. That woman, she seemed lonely. So I thought that the gift might cheer her up. You're impossible, Tapita. You can't go handing out royal property to every Tom, Dick and Sally like that. Oh, right, so we actually have to do that. Crap. Oh, well. I don't, don't get a choice, really. Although I think what I'm going to do is put that on hold for now and instead go back to the hideout. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I should still be able to. Oh, nice. It's, like, it's what I'm hoping for, anyway. Perfect for camping. Do, do, do. <laughs> right, cool. What can the Dragon God do? Change my party. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, balls. No. Da, da, and da. Ooh. But Nina's actually lower level now. Whatever, that's fine. I would save, but meh. Right, so what I want to do... I mean, technically we need to go see the witch. I want to go back to Township, though. Yeah. Oh god, two of these. Great! Ooh, nice. I knew it wasn't going to be enough. Son of a bitch! Nice breath. Oh no. That's a really shitty move. Cause it really does a lot of damage. Oh, we're going back to the camp, I suppose. Oh, real fucking lucky there. Alright, back to the camp. Oh, what a pain in my ass. Sure. Ah, oh, man. Right, okay. Crap. Okay, these aren't too bad. It's just Stoneface. Mostly because Stoneface has access to Ice Breath, which does too much damage. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> right. Sadly, I need to pass through the forest. <laughs> Wait a minute. Can I do? No, it's only on the overworld, I think. I keep forgetting about Rand's. Rand has an ability that lets you move quicker. <clears throat> yeah. Until you hit 
like a wall or something. Or maybe it don't work. Oh no, there we go. Downside is whenever you hit a wall, you get into a fight. It's the only downside to it. But it's a pretty cool thing. Fuck me. Plus side is, we're right next to... Uh, Capitan. So, we should be fine. I was gonna say, assuming that still works. Whoop, shit. I'm hoping it does. Yeah, just to be able to use the dragon... Uh, dragon. The boat to go back across? Yeah, we do. Cool. Phew! That was one worry I had. <laughs> right. <laughs> there we are. I should probably heal. Just to be safe. Oh no, it's for his any. I would indeed. Alright. Uh, to be fair, I think this, the home, not hometown, the township stuff is entirely optional, but it's really good to do. And fairly fun, to be honest. Well, the, the best thing is, I was going to say more XP, but it's really negligible what we get now. The money should be, I would say good, but I'm not entirely sure if it is. Fuck me. Bum, 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 bum. Alrighty. We're nearly, nearly back to Windia. I could not remember the name of the place. Oh no, lizard man! To be fair, getting around the world's not that bad. It will be much better if, and or when, or more so when or if, we get access to Nina's ability. Which is allow, or which allows us to fly around. Yeah, but never mind. There we go. All right. One thing I should also try and do is defeat Wild... what was it called? The Chef. Yeah. I just think that wouldn't... I don't think it'd be that bad if I'm able to use magic. Although I get the feeling I'm not entirely sure if I am. Hmm. By the way... Yeah, play as bloody whoever. Woohoo! Right, so we're getting closer. Oh god. We're near Corsair, I think. Here we are. Ooh, nice. I can't believe these things. They don't even do much. Only thing I really wish is that we had an easier way of getting back to our, uh, like, hideout. It just would be nice, instead of having to go through all this every time. But whatever. <laughs> 14 zenny. Woo! Right, well, there's that. Colosseum Town. I can't remember its actual name. I'm pretty sure it was Corsair. But I could be wrong. Yeah, well. There we go. I've also wanted to go back to the hideout, so I'm curious if anything new's happened. And whether we can get Bosch back on our team. 
I don't know. I don't know when he's gonna join back. I'm assuming he will at some point. It's just a matter of when. Oh my god. Pain in the ass. Oh nice, I got a healing herb. Lovely. Oh wait, where am I going? Shit, what was I doing? <laughs> to be fair, the rest of the session is probably gonna be to do with the hideout. I need to sh make sure it's called Township, because I'm pretty sure it is. Or at least it was in the original game. I mean, this translation might have changed it to something that makes more sense. Township sounds a bit strange. Oh man, look at it. So what is this called? Township. Never mind. Holy balls. Whoa. Is there something here? I picked up Jocko! Oh, right. Mm -hmm. Oops. I thought I was going into the house and ended up going through it. Check every house. We got a wisdom fruit. Mm -hmm. Is there something there? A fire spice. What the hell's this then? Whoa. Hey everybody, what do you want us to cook? Oh, okay. Wait, if I cooked a roast... Thank for waiting. Your charcoal is ready. Oh. Oh no, I got rid of my roasts. They were worth so much money. No. Oh, well. Holy Jesus. Nothing there. Great. This is crazy. This place is huge. So what's in the well? The fuck? I have no idea. This is really weird. <laughs> oh yay. I picked up the diffuse orb. With my new laboratory, I can push the boundaries of fusion farther than anyone has ever dreamed. Wanna give it a shot, or would you like to hear my lecture on the basics first? Let's get started. Alright, now let's get to fusing. Ooh. Index. Who do I want to fuse? Sten. Perform which fusion? Fuse. Sten. Wait, Sesso. Sanamo Fire, I think. I don't know if that's something I have to pay for. Oh, nice! Oh yeah, baby. Fusion really successful. Look at that, I hardly recognize you. You have your new fusion powers to thank for that. Oh man. Oh, man. oh wow, he looks so much different. Has his portrait changed? Yes, it has. Whoa, what happened? Okay, that was cool. I only went for that because it uses explosive magic, so to me it made sense. Explosions are usually fire-based. Where'd they go? In my experience, there are two kinds of princes in this world. The elegant, refined type like our own Nina, and the boisterous, self-centered variety like that Patape character. Petape. Hmm. Okay. I don't know if there's anything else around the village. Well, they do have a bookshelf, but they don't usually contain anything. Oh, I got fast food. Oh, never mind. I don't know if I can do this now. But it's possible to actually grow 
township even further. Essentially, by finding people to occupy the empty houses. So that is essentially what my uh, objective is. What I might do is actually stop by some of the shops and buy smoke bombs. Yeah. Just because it would be a good idea, I think. I won't have to fight a bunch of stuff. Man, look at Sten. He looks completely different. Whoa. That was crazy. Uh, um... Yeah. That did a lot... Wow. I'm just confused. Not confused. Surprised. Do your best out there. Okay, so it's not you. Shoot. It could actually be this one. You say you're building a new town? Wow, I never would have guessed. Can I come there? I'd love to open a weapon, a new weapon shop in your town. That's why you want them. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. You just sit tight. I'll have the best selection you could ever ask for. Yes. They aren't just people that occupy your town. You get a... I think it must be a weapon and armor shop. An item shop. And an inn. I think. The inn might not be right. Actually, come to think of it. I'm in the weapon shop. Why am I here? Do they actually sell anything new? No. They sell crappy things. Either way, the item store might be useful. Here we are. What can I do for you? Wait, what the fuck? Smoke bomb! <gasps> yes. Yeah, perfect. Alright, so there's one down. The downside is now we have to go back to Windia and Capitan. I should use one at smoke bombs. I'll be able to get them much easier then. Wait, so now what I'm realizing now is that Sten's not useless. Like, he's actually really, really tough. Like, he does a lot more damage now than he did before. Alright, I'm gonna use up a smoke bomb. Wait, auto. What am I doing? Wait, what does the fast food do? Increase agility. Oh. I can't help but the lucky charm just does the same. There we are. Should be able to make it all the way back. Never mind. What the fuck? I thought that would have worked, but I guess not. What the heck? Oh well. Can't complain too much, I suppose. Still bullshit, though. I mean, it's not like it completely stops enemies, it's just me enemies left less often. So she does 77. He does 70. So he's only a little bit weaker than Lin. Bad. Not bad at all. I'll actually get him in lead. He's like got a golden vest now, it's cool. Although, to be honest, it doesn't look golden, it just looks yellow. I didn't realize I was gonna give him a color change though. It's very nice, I like it. Really? Oh my god. I can't believe Lin could not kill one of those in one shot. And they have, like, we haven't fought them in so long. Ah, oh dear. Nice. To be fair, considering I'm back out this way, I'm tempted to just do the mission. Like, for... What's his face? Just because I can't be asked going back to Township to come back here. It's just a bit of a pain. I'm so glad he didn't have a death blow too. There we 
very nice. Oh, okay. Fuck my life. I bought smoke so that I didn't have to fight stuff all the bloody time. Just goes to show it's not really doing that much. Oh no! We have been weakened. Right, so, in Windia, I can't remember who it is. No, I can't. Was it somebody that was in a shop? If you head west from here, you'll reach Capitan. No. Oh, bollocks. It's locked! <laughs> Damn it. Because it's night time. I'm only going to do it so that it's no longer night time. You know, the most logical uh, of choices. Cheers, bruh. Now it's daytime. Perfect. I didn't actually know that they shop. Yeah, I didn't know the shops did. Really? You got your own town? I could have my very own store there. Wouldn't you let me come to your town? Of course. Thank you so much, I'll do my best. There we go. Wait, so what? Oh, this is the armory. Oh. Hmm. Oh, I've just realised who the sages stuff can be for. Nina! I'll actually just put her in the party then. I have to go with four people? Really? What a pen. Right, equip Nina. Warlock ring. Okay. Right, we're good. I can get rid of Nina now. It's really weird just how quickly we got new party members. Right, so Lynn, Sten, and Rand. Yeah! Oh, shit. I mean, I could go with Lynn, Sten, and Nina. I like... I like Rand, though. Yeah, I'll just go with Rand. I like Nina, too. But the, I still don't really know what I want my staple party to be. Obviously Ryu. But that's a given. Considering. He's kind of the poster boy of the game. So obviously he's going to be part of it. Doo doo doo. <laughs> Uh, right. I'm just gonna use up another smoke. I don't care. What's skin thing do? Temporarily boost attack. Uh, okay. Yeah, wards off random encounters. For no time at all. Maybe it's because I'm running. So that's covering like double the distance. That might be why it runs out so quick. It would be nice if it gave you a little light. Not explanation. Just if it told you when it ran out. So then you can start to expect enemies, but whatever. Damn it. No, we're nearly there. <clears throat> Death blow. Do -do 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 -do. Ah oh, man. Well, he did. I'm so glad I didn't do poison breath. That's still probably my least favorite attack. Just because it seems to poison <laughs> all of the party. 90% of the time. Right, and the other person is in the inn. Somewhere. Ah, oh, there he is. The old man. Old man. What, you built a new town somewhere? Please, let me set up a shop in your town. You got it. You don't know what this means to me. Finally, I can settle down. You're welcome, birdie. We're building an empire. It's a really cool feature this game has, to be honest. Just, you know, having your own settlement, in a way, it's just really cool. Alright, so now it's time to go back.
to the witch's hideout. Of all bloody places. Downside is I have to go back up to the fucking top floor. Which means I have to go through the entire dungeon again. I'm not gonna lie, it's not exactly exciting. All to help out Jean. Maybe she's like on the bottom floor just to make things nice and easy for me, but fucking doubt it. It's never usually the case. They usually do like go out of their way to kick your ass. Ooh, nice. Well, one bottom feed is probably dead. There you go. Yeah, he does a lot more damage now. These give you like nearly two grand XP. Nice. I think I might actually go to the... Try and see if I can deal with... The chef. I'm mostly just curious. Okay. Alright, so... I need to remember how it works. I might just try and not leave my stuff. Might so save. I would indeed. It might still be something that I can't do, but if I can use magic then it should be perfect. Sure. Alright, let's see. I thought I was going to get into a fight before I could do anything. May leave the recruitment and possessions here. Do it! Alright, so that's one's ignored. Dear sirs, did you not read the signs? You have to follow protocol. Do you want to eat here or not? Of course I do. Go back to the entrance, follow search this time, be quick about it. Oh, fuck. Of course I do. Aw, oh, man. Fine, I can't do that. I think I realise how this works. Because the last sign, it asks... It asks... Like, what you would like your meat to be. Last time I did this, I said well done. I think what you choose for the final thing determines how much health damage you take. I think so. Which is really clever. Liberally apply salt and pepper. Seems odd about the last instruction, but they did it anyway. It's like covering yourself in some salt and pepper. Yeah, here it is. You're almost done. How would you like your meat cooked? Rare, medium, well done. So, like, I did well done, which meant I was near death. Really, really early on. Rare. So if I do rare, that means I'll barely take much damage. Hopefully. Oh my god! Mmm, something sounds good. Ought to be done by now. Ah, oh, man undercooked again? I gotta adjust the thermostat on this thing. Oh no, you're crying over spilled milk. I'll just chop you guys up into itty- into itty bitty cube steaks. <laughs> yeah, there we go, we took a, a bit less damage. I can do specials. Oh! Well, in that case, I could probably finish this. Here and now. Well, maybe. I'm just gonna go with this, and probably the same. There's one. Samoon. Defending. Frost Strike, I don't know how much this will do. I'm hoping a fair bit. Oh my god. Oh my god, it was that easy. Lynn's level 20. That was a lot. Ah, oh, tough me today. Alright then, time to use my special desperation move. Hasta la vista. <laughs> what the fuck? Whoa. Hold up. You're looking for Nympho? Oh, she's probably in the corner getting hammered. 
Oh, I need to be here. The Black Cats Academy annual reunion party is today. Damn, I hope we've got some top grade meat left some over somewhere for him. So Nympho is probably in here. Nothing matters, nothing matters anymore. Who love a wreck like this, huh? Huh? Nobody, that's who. Uh, haven't I seen that smug little face of yours someplace else? Come back to laugh at your former captor in her darkest hour, is that it? Well, come on. Go ahead and laugh. I don't care anymore. Why, you want a ring? Somebody gave me? Oh, the annoying frog. Here, take it. But wait, I thought I had it right here. Where the hell did it go? Oh, don't tell me I dropped it in the toilet. Ah, screw it. It's just a stupid hunk of lead anyway. I'm not going to waste any tears on it. You want that ring? Then fetch, Fido. I'm not going to follow you down there. Do you want to go down the toilet? <laughs> yes. Ugh. Oh my god, really? Oh, it's there. I see it. Hooray! Wait, how the... Oh, wait. Maybe I'm able to just... Reaches for the ring. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah, <laughs> Hand slit, the ring starts floating away. Great. I'm kind of screwed then, aren't I? Unless it floats up here. Of course. Aha! I obtained the royal signet. There we go, we got it. Well, that was easy. Who would have thought a toilet led into a cave? Yo, you guys reek. Are you nuts or something? What the hell is so important about that ring you f that you'd flush yourselves down the john to get it back? The royal signet of fought whatever that place is called, get out of town. Who the hell in the right or wrong mind would give the keys to the freaking kingdom to a witch? You just leave me alone. I know you have to be lying. Who on earth would trust something like the royal signet to a worthless thing like me? She's so hard on herself. Oh wow, everybody cleared out. This really was unforgettable. Here are the positions you checked in. Have a safe journey, please come again. Oh, there we go, perfect. So I should have got all my shit back too. Yeah, we did. Nice. Also, I have the deluxe rod. Perfect. Although I've not done any fishing. I'm just not something that interests me. At this present time. Sure. Okay, save. Of course. Right, so, we have the, the ring. So I'm guessing the... Oh shoot, where am I going? I'm guessing what's his face can probably come back. As in, like, join the party again. That's what I'm hoping. <laughs> right, so... We did it! Oh my... God! Right, so it's up here, and then straight up. Even higher! There we go! We did it! Merci, merci beaucoup! You have recovered the proof of my royal bloodline. Again, words cannot express my gratitude, so many sad and beautiful memories this ring has. This was the only way I could think of to tell her what she meant to me. Ah, it is better to have loved and lost, so much better to have loved and lost. The serenade can wait. We've got fr a fraud to dethrone. My dear sister, always so impatient. Your little heart might explode if you are weak, if you are always in such a hurry. Let me soothe you with my melodious voice. <laughs> Sometimes I don't know why I put up with you. The world could be coming to an end, and you'd still find some excuse to give off. Now come on, your country's at stake. All right. <laughs> My dear sister, you wound me. Do you seek to tear this kingdom in two? Why do you side with that filthy I imitation? Surely you are not so naive to think that he is the genuine article. Shut up, you cheap carbon copy. You're the imitation here, and you know it. My real brother is standing over there, and he's going to kick your ass so hard you'll be looking for it next year. <laughs> Petapa. I am ashamed such unladylike conduct does not befit you. You too, can it? 
Freedom and wheat, Bozo. We got the royal signet and you don't. Your ring will prove to everybody that you're the real prince, Tapeta. Go on and show it to them. Ah, we oui, behold. Stick that in your pipe and smoke it. How do you explain this, huh? That ring proves that he's the real Tapeta and you're just a big phony. A big fat phony. You shut my heart, dear sister. Speaking such horrible things of me. Uh-oh. As you see, I happen to have the royal signet right here. I've had enough of these silly games of yours, Pat uh, Petapa. This ring of proof that I am indeed who you say I am not. No? Uh-oh. No way. There can't be two royal signets. Yours must be a fake, just like you. You wound me again and again and again with your silly foolishness, Petapa. But perhaps you will relinquish your delusions once this imposter has been put to death for his treason. What? <laughs> Dad, I mean, Father, you can't believe this imposter. Tapata needs your help. Have this fraud sent to the dungeon at once. Oh, I thought I was hearing things. How's your mother doing? Is she still preparing tonight's ban banquet? If you can get a word in edgewa edgewise... Remind her to make some of that fly pudding of hers. Mom's probably rolling in her grave thanks to you, you senile old toad. There's no time to be thinking about your overgrown belly. Your son's throne is on the line and all you can say is this. A fly pudding. Everyone knows my real brother's fly pudding is the best in the world. There's no way any imposter could copy that. So you're asking me to prove my royal lineage in a chef's duel. If pudding is what my sister wants, then pudding is what she shall receive. There's not anything I would not make for my little Petapa. I am, after all, the greatest chef in the kingdom. Don't screw this up, Tapita. You know as well as I do that nobody can beat you in the kitchen. Oui, oui, but of course. And if I lose, there will be no hard feelings, yes? Uh, surely you jest. Your very existence is an affront to my honour. Should you lose, I will take great pleasure in having you and all your little accomplices ex executed. Guys, take this fraudulent creature and his associates to the kitchen. This way, move it. Alright. <laughs> Welcome to the ring. You've got some balls challenging the prince to a duel. He's the best chef in the whole kingdom and damn proud of it. Here's the battle plan, Tapita. You're going to make a, a green bottle pudding, your secret weapon, remember? The absolute best. There's one taste and the king will have no choice but to recognise you. But of course, but of course. However, the best cuisine requires the best ingredients, and the ordinary palace stock simply will not do. I think I shall start with my cockroach salad with wild onions. Then there will be fam my famous worm caramel. And for dessert I will pair the legendary green bottle pudding, which no one can resist. I ask you all to aid me by collecting the vital ingredients, see we'll play. What a charming menu you've chosen. Cock cockroach, worm and the rare green bottle. I am salivating at the merest thought of it. I shall prepare my dishes with those exact same ingredients. After all, how could I resist the opportunity to make all of my dear sister's favourites? My brother won't lose to a fake like you. Next to him, you couldn't even boil water. The noise from your mouth tires me. Yes, when you taste my masterpiece, it will remove all doubt as to who is real and who is, how you say, a fraud. And once I triumph over this foolish imposter, I will see to it that he and his troublemaking friends will have their entrails adorning the battlements of this castle. As you say, no pressure. Wait, what? You heard him just now. If my brother doesn't win this chef's duel, he'll have every one of, every single one of you killed. I say unto you, in the words of my ancestors, <laughs> à la cuisine. Ah, oh, great. Hey, the WC. What a perfect place to end the session. So, that's going to be the end of this session. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed. And until next time, take care.